What are you doing? I am. I am. I am. I think the volume is very high. Ironing. Is that your uniform? No. Who's yours? <laughs> my uniform. Mm -hmm. Why are you ironing my uniform? It seems like you've forgotten that today you go to work. So I'm doing that for you. Is it what you always do or it's just for I always, Congress? always, always. She wants to report to me that I don't iron my uniform. She has been but you know you don't, so I do it always. Besides, I don't wait for you. Once it's washed, I have to iron it and hang them. I can't wait till you are ready to go to work before I come and iron them. No. Oh, she wants to tell everybody that she's a good wife. Yeah, so I iron all of it. I'm ironing all. And I don't have time to be doing it one by one. Wife material. Five thousand. <laughs> guys, she wants to tell you guys that I'm very lazy, but that's not the case. That's but not you know that you you, are, you know already that I'm lazy. Uh, I never said you are lazy. I just said you know. So you added the lazy. I didn't say anything. Ironing is not anything big. It's not big deal. You know, it's not something. So that why I don't should... you? Oh, like, you no. wait till you are ready to go to work before you go and look for your uniform. <laughs> uh, I think I have to end the video. She's just, she just, <laughs> she just painting me black. She's just painting me black. I think she, um, the moment she saw me taking a camera, she just went in and bring my uniform, trying to iron it and make people see that so I don't usually do ironing. She I mean, has been doing the ironing. Always. It's true. I know you. You always I iron. Uh, so I'm, why is it because you brought the camera? I started before you even went for your phone. I don't know how to end it. I've I've already got one hanging already. So already used. Is that so? Not new. Hmm. Uh -huh, so I have some the new ones. Oh okay. Anyway, it looks like you've got nothing to do at the moment. That's the reason. I'm cooking. Sure. Uh -huh. Are you sure about that? I'm cooking. Let me, let, let me find my way to the kitchen and see what you're doing over there. Trying all my meat. <laughs> Guys, looks like she was cooking. But this doesn't make me lazy anyway. It doesn't make me lazy. Like I was busy, I was busy with my laptop. I was actually doing something. Editing your videos. <laughs> yeah, and she just she just went for the uniform. It's not even it's not even around four, it's not even five or six. I'll be leaving for work around half six, so it's not anything big, it's not a big deal. <laughs> How are you gonna do? Pack your bag. Okay. I've got nothing to say. You still have spoon in your bag. I don't know who got that spoon in there. It's from the last food is here. The last food? That was that's about that's Saturday. That's yesterday. Yeah, that's that's about a week and three days now. Yeah. My son the spoon, I picked the bowl in. She picked the bowl but left the spoon in. So guys, it's not my fault, it's not me. Mm -hmm. Anyway. So guys, I've always been saying that um this this is the kind of things uh you see ladies if you like marry you shouldn't be like acting like um these are specific stuff for guys to do these are specific size for uh we ladies to do um it's a shared responsibility Where there is portal, you just feel it that's all i think that that's it but i have a question for you do you want to answer what? um i've been battling with this question for quite a um, number of days now but um why is it that when you ladies, when you give birth, you always neglect your men and concentrate on the babies? You're an old man. You can take off yourself. The new one needs to be nurtured, so all attention needs to be shifted to that side. Look at what she's saying. So, um, had, had it not been me, mm -hmm. would you have gotten that young one? No. So why do you shift all your attention towards the young one he and neglect your man? So should we all shift our attention to the young one? No. Why? They don't have so much role to play. I don't have so much role to play. 
Just work and bring the money. That's all. Work and bring the money. Look at her. <laughs> all you need is money. That's all you need. Money, 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 money. Guys. <laughs> Just so I can make the money, you know. So, so why do you always do that? Like neglect fathers. We don't neglect. It's not. Ne we don't intentionally, intentionally neglect. But you know, he needs more attention. Mm -hmm. I and, understand. Yeah. So I admit. You're always with the, the baby. You're always with the baby. That is it. There are some. There are some ladies. They will not even like a great young man getting closer to the baby. They always want to. Is it because? You always want to get something valuable on Mother's Day and the man will always get towered on Father's Day. You know, I was reading a post this afternoon. Mm -hmm. The person is a nurse mm -hmm. working at the male's ward. Mm -hmm. And she was, there's was, a scenario that when, she, when you go to the male ward, you see only the wives attending to their husbands. Mm -hmm. so attending to the husbands, mm -hmm. like the men on admission. Mm -hmm. You don't normally see the children coming around, mm -hmm. but when you go to the female's ward, mm -hmm. hardly you will see their husbands, mm -hmm. but their kids up and down, mm -hmm. always staying with their mothers. So that connection is there, no matter how tight you are with your, your child as a man, he would definitely be closer to the woman. It's natural. Right now, if I hear my, my dad is sick, I'll, take, I'll go, I'll pass by, but if it was my mom, mm -hmm. I would go and stay. Because I'm a lady, she's my mom, I will go and stay. Guys, it should be... You, you, That's my dad. The guys are there. If they can go and stay with him, fine. I'll find someone to stay with him, but my mom, I will be there. So that connection is there natural. No matter how bad your mom is, you have that feeling for your mom. From... Infancy, so Guys, yes. may the Lord forgive our ladies. It's not true. May the Lord forgive our babies. You always do this. I know you guys do this because you want to get something valuable oh, on Mother's Day. Day. And then we will be always be getting towels oh. on Mad Father's Day. We call to read them just happy Mother's Day. And they are okay with it. And I guess they are okay. They appreciate it a lot. Guys, if, you should, you, you, should you, I give birth right now? Mm -hmm. My daddy will never come and stay with me. Mm -hmm. Will he? No. Oh no, you should go and work and get money. Go, exactly. But my mom will be working. Will, be also, will also be working. But she will leave the work mm -hmm. and come and stay with me. Should both of them leave the work? Who is going to pay the bills? So they let my mom work and let my dad come and stay with me. If, it's if not that's, possible. It's possible. He won't do that. He won't do that because you won't allow. He you won't, won't agree. You won't agree to he that. Won't. You ladies always want your mom around you and he not um, the other but way around. My mom, he will, she will leave whatever she's doing, come and stay with me as long as I want before she goes. So why won't I give her something good on Mother's Day and just wish my daddy happy for Father's Day? You, sh you should you should also give daddy something valuable because should daddy leave his work, mm -hmm. who is going to afford the He's bills? So Nobody's going to afford the bills. Mommy will be working, will be working mm -hmm. coming here to stay with you and still be working. Since is that the case? Here, no, once she's here, she won't be working. I mean, her work is to take care of me and her kid. Exactly. So if mom is here with you and mm -hmm. like dad is also here with you, who is going to afford the bills? Dad will never come. He will come and spend like a day or two and go. Because back. that's what you want. That is it. He wants. And you know, when you go to some of the hospitals, there are these kids, um, these fathers who also take care of their kids. When you go to children's hospitals. Once the mother is in, he will leave. Sometimes the kids stay with their daddies. Sometimes the kids you even cry if they are, when their daddies are living. Percentage. Even if it's a percentage, even if it's just one oh, percent. So it's just, just a little minute portion of the. Even if it's insignificant, oh, it's still it's still possible. So it's possible, but it's not real. It's not really. I mean, it doesn't happen often. So it always happens. Oh, always happens. Better. You ladies, I think it's high time you better. change. Better. It's high time you change because. This time, the kind of the kind of men that we are coming, like the kind of men that you we are to compete in for this, attention you see, that's what you that think. Your mindset. Compete like the for kind attention. Of men that's coming, you want to compete for attention. Like really? Compete? What do you mean by competing for Mommy attention? Women and children are just like that. I mean, they are like that. It's true, but um, that doesn't mean that he's competing for attention. Some there are some kids that will never sleep until they see their dad. 
There are some kids that will never eat until they see their dad. And their mom will be around. All right now, let their mom get sick right now. They'll leave their father and come and save their mom. It doesn't mean they don't care about their fathers. Good. That has, that's but not... they will get a excuse. If my daddy is sick, I'll get an excuse not to go. Like, if I don't want to, I'll get an I just Oh, let's find someone and pay the person. What about mommy? You can also find somebody. I'll prefer going to do it myself. She's my mom. Anyway. So mommy's love are natural and natural. Naturally, that bonding is unbreakable. Fathers, we appreciate all that they do for us, you know. We really appreciate. But they can never compete with, with mommy for that kind of bonding. Nah. Mommies are always the best. Mom, don't worry. Babe. <sighs>